So hello and welcome to all of you who are watching our coverage of match day two. A very, very warm welcome to you. The first round of fixtures have been and gone. We're back for more. They did lose on opening day. They've had good time for reflection. The three match sound bites were certainly upbeat, but the prospect of an early exit remains a worry unless they produce right here, right now. And we have in front of us this gloriously imposing arena, absolutely picture-perfect for a game of this nature. So some ground already to be made up, but it is an early point in the competition, this. Yes, Peter, but they're a long way off having to think about pressing the panic button just yet. So as long as it hasn't hit their belief too hard, I think they can start thinking about how they're going to improve starting, obviously, now. It's pointless looking back. This requires a more positive approach and the very real possibility that they can generate proper momentum from here better late than never. So we're up and running. Jim, which player is best equipped for this game? Well, Draxler is a big talent. He can do a good job for his team in any of the attacking positions, but the extra little freedom he gets a wide play to his technical strengths and his ability to go either left or right. Yes, he'd be my pick too. It's going to be all about how they get the best out of him. Can take battles to win it back. Raspilicueta. Werner. Cut out in the nick of time. Danger averted for now. And it's Marcos Alonso. It's gone a long way up and away. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Draxler. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Whipped in. Towering header! He's done well to get his head on that, but couldn't score. I have to commend the wing plate, but I have to condemn the defending. They've got to stop the cross. Marcos Alonso. Good spell of possession, this, but very little to show for it. Raspilicueta. Hoist it forward. Either side yet able to force a breakthrough here. Back into the middle. Oh, that's clearly not what he wanted to do. Keylor Navas gets it upfield. Marcos Alonso. He's looking to get there first. Christensen, and it's played forward, Werner is flagged offside.
Conte. For a moment you felt that was going somewhere, but they'll have to go again. Looks to thread it through. Marcos Alonso. Raspilicueta. It's all a little short of forward momentum, lacking thrust. Marcos Alonso. And it's Marcos Alonso. Just brushed off the ball there. Marquinhos. Draxler. Kimpembe. Bernat. Danilo Pereira. Neymar. Half an hour played now. Florenzi. Draxler. Neymar. Had a shot. There was plenty of power on that. Raspinacueta. Werner. Marco Verratti. If you have just joined us, you'll be glad to know that you haven't missed a goal. Florenzi. And it's Neymar. Going for goal! And again, the keeper stands strong. Oh, that's a stunning save. I mean, his reflexes were incredible then. That's as good a save as you'll see. Di Maria with the short one. That is terrific skill. Di Maria. Verna. Giroud. Verratti gets it back. Neymar. Mbappe. Mbappe! This could fall anywhere. Oh, that is asking for trouble. Well read, he sorted that out. Chip through. And the whistle goes for half time. So now the team has broken through. Not for the want of trying. Interesting game up to now. Still goals. How do you review the first half? Well, this has proved a very frustrating day so far, especially for the strikers. Nothing has been created for them. I think the service has been extremely poor. So they head in, no further forward. The score here, still, nil-nil. It's Giroud! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Oh, I'm not sure what he had in mind, and I don't think he knew either. Mbappe. Mbappe! Too close for comfort. Marcos Alonso. Christensen Conte and it's Giroud Giroud needed to come up with a better ball the movement was good but the pass lacked authority uh, a cause of mild frustration forward it goes Neymar
questions were asked, and he's given the answers. Raspilicueta. Not long left, and still we await the breakthrough. Lovely bit of skill. Draxler. Kimpembe. Marco Verratti. Florenzi. Marquinhos plays it forward. And here's Neymar. Bernat with a massive leap. Went with his head, but couldn't steer it in. A heavy challenge. And no, that is pretty much the end of that. That's been a question. Conte. And it's Giroud. Oh, good interception. Now it's Draxler. And here's Di Maria. Out to the right. Florenzi. Great lead! Just off target. Good effort. Very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. Paris Saint-Germain are making a change now. Marcos Alonso. Pulisic. Raspilicueta. Chelsea merit full marks for their attitude and application in trying to win this. It means an awful lot, obviously. And it's Florenzi. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Concentration levels are very good, and so is the commitment. This game could yet yield a winner. Clear cut, it's a free kick. Kimpembe. Pablo Sarabia. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Look, this can still go either way. It might be flowing one way, but there's still time for some ebb. Now it's Giroud. Offside, yes it is. Chelsea showing a good level of intensity at this stage. They're calling on all their resources now. Yeah, it's pretty obvious as to who was going to be taken off. His energy levels began to, to sag, and he was never going to last until the final whistle. Good ball. Cuts it out. Kimpembe, Pablo Sarabia, and that's the end of that, it all started well enough. Rubiga, Pulisic, it is now or never, time is against them, and it's got through, in comes the corner. Marcos Alonso. He's gone for it! And the referee brings it to a close. A frustrating game for attack.